top down list i'm going to show we look up formula donut chart and finally dynamic chart so with dynamic chart you can create a dashboard okay so let's get started so firstly we have a data over here we notice that this company they have a production according to the respective seasons so the peak seasons has about 80% production normal season have about 50% production and during the movement control order especially during the covid-19 pandemic this company has a production of 25% so now how am i going to demonstrate this into a dynamic chart okay so what i'm going to do is first step is i'm going to create a drop down list so you put yourself over here you go to data okay you go to data and the next step is you go to data validation so once you go to data validation the next step is a window will pop up so in this window this data validation window you go to your allow and you click list once you click list you go to the source and you highlight the entire details and then you press enter okay now we have the information season normal season and movement control order all right so what i'm going to do is the next step is i'm going to teach you on we look up formula so we use equal we look up okay so if you are using excel 365 you use x look up however if you are using microsoft 2016 you can use the we look up so this is our look up value our table array and then we are highlighting the second column and then pods so this is our data so as you can see if i were to pick season it shows 80% if i were to pick normal season it shows 80% and if i were to pick it will be 80% so the next step is i use the equal 80% and equal 1 minus 80% so now you have this data over here and i'm going to go to the insert and i'm going to go to this pie chart or donut chart so i go to this donut and i click over here all right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to click this and i'm going to change the format maybe to dark blue dark blue and this data over here i want to put it as uh, dark blue as well and put it as no outline all right this thing over here i'm going to put here equal and i'm going to put here pick season so this thing i'll put it bold and i'm going to put it black all right and i'm going to remove the legends and then you have your data all right so the next step what i'm going to do is i'm going to click this i'm going to go to insert illustration and i put this a box so i'm going to create a box over here i'm going to put this on the center i just want to remove the outline and also the fill the next step is put here equal and 80% so now you have this information over here so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go home and i'm going to enhance the size center and middle all right so now i'm going to put it over here so with one click if just say i were to click movement control order so you notice that we have about a production of 25% however if i were to click normal season you will have a production of 50% and if i were to click on peak season you have a production of 80%. So this is actually a dashboard that you can build using the drop down list, we look up formula and donut chart. In other words, this is known as the dynamic